I'm gonna say shit cam, girl. Oh, come on, Armani. Velvet ants are so cute, but they, they hurt. They're not they're not cute when they bite you. I fucking love Central Yarn on. Okay. We're just not gonna fuck with the giant anymore. We're just gonna get the shards and we'll yarn them. Living Cali, all we have here really is black widows and drunk celebs in cars. Nice. It's fun web spiders scared the living shit out of me. I live in a safe place, but fuck that. I'm gonna stay at least five countries away from those monsters, scariest fangs I've ever seen. And the poison kills you in minutes. When are you gonna stop being a vassal to the king of cuck, Anthony Birch? I have no idea. Won't ban just because someone's belligerent. Said said is advocating for not banning people due to belligerency. I don't know what I, I think I should think about this. Got a spiderology degree, 300k salary rap god reporting. How do you like your line of work, Deadshot? Why is Anthony Birch the king? I don't even know who Anthony Birch is, so... <laughs> that, uh... I don't know what that says about me. No fucking clue who that is. Not even the slightest. Alright, so... Hopefully I won't fuck this shit up. We always have a shit first run. And that's the only time we're gonna die tonight. You should replace him with me as your front-running memer mod. We should ban anyone who isn't belligerent. Yeah, you right. I heard about this crazy new fad that all the kids are doing these days. It's called cucking, and I'm sure you'd love it. I'm sure I would love to cuck somebody. Funnel webs are aggressive as fuck, too, but luckily there's a cure for their bites, and we haven't had a fatality for a long time. Well, that's good. That's still... I don't know, it still probably wouldn't be very exciting to be attacked by one. Maybe it would be exciting, it's not fun. He got ultra cut. Please, like, I've had people tell me that he's been ultra cut. Please elaborate, because I'm too lazy to look up what happened myself. Did he just, like, come home and, like, 17 fucking black guys were banging her? Like, five white guys and maybe an Asian in there in the mix. And he's just like, oh, no! We should ban Tolo IRL. According to the Twitch app, I'm watching an ad even though it's the stream. Hopefully you're getting paid for all this. I mean, I do get money for ads now. Assumed his throne. Was it a willing assumption of the throne, though? Oh, fuck. I fucked it up. Takes many years of practice to cuck someone else, gotcha. I'd love to smoke some cuck with you one day, Tolo. We we can do that. We have a mad chill cuck sesh, fam. <laughs> I I have a feeling you're uh, you're ribbing on the stoner the stoner crew a little bit. I don't I don't know why though. Your name's Kyle, yeah, it is. Or if you live in Texas you call me Cal. Fucking Cal. Fuck, I hate that shit. No one knows how to pronounce my name. Leave me alone, you fucking dude. Jesus. Oh my. Mm -mm. Worst enemy in any game ever. You should have said something total. I've been ad block. No, continue to ad block my stream. Don't, uh, don't fucking make exceptions for me. I, I think ads are the devil and you should continue ad blocking. You're not Jewish? No, I'm not. I heard a cure for venomous snake bites costs like 100. I have no idea. That sounds. It, it sounds like it depends on the snake. If it's something like a rattlesnake, I can't see that being true. But if it's like one of the more uncommon venomous snake bites, then that wouldn't surprise me. You name it. They just. They pronounce it. Like, uh. Like. Horribly. I, I, I don't know how to explain any any better than that, but they cannot pronounce the word like the name Kyle worth a shit. Cow. Did you hear Shrekly the money whore got arrested? Yes. Just think stoners are clowny and stupid sounding. Some of them are, but 
You can say the same thing about gamers too, so... The guy just got the shit cucked out of him and posted about it on Twitter to announce his claim into the throne of Kakuri. Okay, I still need to read this shit. Also, when I was a, when I was a baddie to Romeo, my sister used to call me Kai Kai. So if you want to call me Kai Kai and embarrass me, you can. Okay, let me see. He was lying in bed and his wife came home after having a date and having sex. He's in an open relationship, even going on blind dates with guys for some strange reason. And eventually, his wife just flat out admitted she's leaving him and took his stuff. Damn. <laughs> Damn. He's the cuck, dude. That's a, that's a prestigious fucking position. The cuck. Oh, fuck yeah, baby. Throw a knife. What's going on, Romero? How are you, man? Oh, that fucking bullet miss. I'm calling shenanigans. I need to be reimbursed via Obama phone after that. Fucking discrimination right there. KO the invoker. Oni Why is Onision the only the ultimate cuck? The guy outed his own cuckery, apparently so. He tried to come across as some ultra progressive liberal that supported women's rights to control her own snatch. Nice. It's being jelly time. My name is a fan of, I can't yeah, I'm not even gonna fucking take a swing at that one. I, I'm not gonna be able to pronounce that. Kubrick. Athanasios. That's that's my that's my jab at it. Do you ever wish you could go back to your Taiwanese home fucking Taiwanese homeland? Uh I mean there are Asian waifus there, so if that was my homeland I would want to go back, but it's not actually my homeland, so um Is getting cucked in public and being happy about it actually being cucked at all? Um, well, being cucked is kind of the perspective of other people. Like, even if you legitimately enjoy being in an open relationship where your wife, like, fucks five guys a day and none of them are you, everyone else is still going to consider you a cuck, so... I would say yes, it's still being a cuck. Simply opening up the definition of being... Shut... Logan... Okay, Logan. Done with finals and I get a cold, impeccable timing. Damn, dude, that, that kind of sucks. I hope you did well on finals and I hope you feel better soon, though. If Tolomeo's homeland was Taiwan, his sister would be- What the fuck? Is it like some manner of incest thing that I don't know about in Taiwan? Is that like the Texas of Asia? What's going on, Roxanne? How are you? Okay, what the fuck am I doing with my life? Oh, yeah. Nothing. Holy shit. I I hate how if you fuck that initial rollout of the uh, jumping, jumping off of a cliff, you, it takes like 20 years to recover. Thought your sister liked Asian guys? She does, but she might. Like, I don't know. She, she likes a very specific type of Asian guy. Like, I'm gonna wear 50 gallons of glitter and makeup and sing fucking songs. Kind of Asian guy. What happened was that Onision posted a pic of his wife like almost kissing this girl so ever, everyone started spamming Cucky McFucky in his comments so he made a joke video about his wife leaving him for this girl which included her making out with this girl while he stood right there but it's not cheating if she's a girl. Oh shit, oh no. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh, oh no. I can't even be in a mode spamming shit lord anymore. Yeah, that's right. We, we've banned emotes in my channel. If you could go to any nightclub in the world, what country would you want it to be in? Oh, God. <sighs> Probably Japan, because as far as I know, like, dancing is illegal there. Like, dancing after a certain point in the night is, like, against the law. So that sounds like it would add in... Like, not only would I be a Japanime rap guy, but I would be... Uh, I would be dancing illegally, and that's something I've always wanted to do. Please let me know if you're coming to Taiwan. I, what's going on, Niley? I, I, I'm probably not, but I, if I do, I will let you know. 
And I don't know if I said hello to you. If I didn't, what's going on, Rainbow Academy? Why does everyone think it's not cheating? Because... Basically... The toxic masculinity is not threatened if it's a woman cucking you, Roxanne. You don't feel and fit you. It's not like, does this guy have a bigger dick? Does this guy have better muscles? Does this guy get paid more? It's, you know what I mean? What's going on, Penguin? Are you going to be lead actor in a new Footloose? No. Hello, pigs. How are you doing, man? Sister likes KJ pop stars because they're adorable. She doesn't like J pop, actually. She. She said basically, I don't like J-pop singers because they sound like, they, they all sound nasally. And I'm like, okay. That's pretty fucking racist. That, her words, not mine. What's going on, guy named Eric? How are you? I'm, I'm gonna take extreme pleasure in cucking you with Molotov's gas going. Oh, nice dodge, buddy. Yeah, but can you dodge him point blank? No, but you can tank through him and not get staggered by a fucking Molotov. Hyper Armor is the best mechanic in the game. Is Tolo's sister hot? No. I should just start saying she's a blue whale so people stop asking me that. That was a pretty good swing, if I do say so myself. We almost got him. Okay. How was my day? My day was pretty good. I'm tired, though, as per usual. How was yours, Saros? Oh, shit. I didn't want a strong attack there. I could have gotten cucked. Could have got put in the shed. Okay. I'm behind on chat. Imagine the Mikolash. Oh god, how'd the gun run go? Well, we finished it, Ponglin, but we fucked up and didn't eat the cord, so we didn't kill Moon Presence. Orphan was actually kind of a bitch. I'm not gonna lie. I I died quite a few times to both Orphan and Maria. I think what's funny is that guys think lesbians are hot, but all the ones I know look like scary dudes. <laughs> You can't cut Gascoigne unless you're a necrophiliac. Final midterms tomorrow, then Christmas break. Godspeed, Kumama. I wish you the best. I think they're just called hideous land beasts, or if they're not fat, I call them sea hags. Like, you, you, the fucking things in The Witcher 3. Why would you ask him if his sister's hot? That's just wrong. I mean, it's not wrong, but I mean, I'm not gonna give you a fucking accurate answer. It's like, there, there's no, there's no good thing I can say. You know? I can say... Well, yes, she's hot. And then everyone's like, ah, you're fucking, you're fucking incest. I could say she's ugly. It's like, you're a bad bro. Like, it's one of those questions where, like, nothing you can possibly fucking say besides blowing it off would be an appropriate answer. You know what I mean? It was good. Are you a movie person? No, I'm not. Bringing you all the Michael Rosen rap. Okay. Water. Is that what they were fucking called? Tolo got triggered, and I'm- I mean, it's the same thing every time. Like, you can't eat- it's always Mikolash, Rom, Calvion, other shit. Like, it's- it's the same formula, and it's getting kind of stale. Because both answers fuck you over. I mean, I don't have to answer, I can blow it off, though. Like, I- I, I don't have to say anything that's, like, a serious answer. Tolo, are you Tolomeo triggered? No, I don't identify as Tolomeo triggered currently. Okay, so we're gonna get some of the shards, but not the ones by the big ass giant. I plead the fifth. That's what I should say, Pongwen. That's really what I should say. What's going on, Double? It's going well. How are you doing, man? So I can dodge that one. Are your genetics typically typically considered favorable? No, not really. Is your sister spicy? Um, well, I have no. <laughs> I feel like if you were to call lesbians water hags, they'd find a way to spin it as sexist and homophobic because 
Oh, damn. I can't... That feel when I can't say what you just said. You can say she's a beautiful per... <laughs> I'm not saying that, Rainbow Okami. They can spin anything. Yeah, dude. Sukin. If you're talking about SJWs and fucking feminists, like, they literally argue with definitions of words. Like, they change the definitions of what words actually mean. Like, racism isn't, be like, discriminating against our race. It's, it's, uh, it's privilege plus race or whatever the fuck equation they use. They will change the definitions of words they use to argue. So, like, arguing with them is the most asinine and it, it's just not worth your time. It's just, you have to get to the point where you just laugh at how retarded they are. Well, myself, what run, run am I doing? I'm doing permadeath with the torch once I get the torch. It'll be Hunter's Torch only. And the Rose Marinus too, in the event that I cannot damage an enemy with fire. She's not a pepper. If you had a chance to have sex with an enemy in Bloodborne, what would the enemy be? Well, I gotta go- I gotta say the fucking tick bitches in Kanehurst look like, like they are quite limber. They think race is the same as class. Yeah, they, it's like... It's the dumbest shit. Just do not even pay attention to what they have to say. Because, like, if you, if you use, like, definitions of words like a horrible human being, if you use logic, that kind of shit, they're just going to change the definitions and pretend they're right. So, you, you just do the same thing. Like, if you get into an argument, just change the definitions of words because they do the same thing. And you can just have fun with it. I had a friend and I was saying how stupid Tumblr feminism is and she got really angry and said she's a feminist, we're not friends anymore. Nice. The name male man must be changed to person person so as not to be offensive to women anymore. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Sif, stop slurping. Amelia the fucked up reindeer would be my pick. Orphan of cause, I love them young. Ah, he doesn't look too young to me. Imagine if the street sharks couldn't be parried, backstabbed, or staggered. Well, at least you figured out something original. That's kind of triggering. Bi people are disconcerting to me because they have, like, double the potential to cheat. I've heard that bi people are actually treated worse than, like, homosexual people. Because, like, neither, neither group of uh, straight people feels comfortable around them. They feel like they're threatened and, like, being, uh being sexualized no matter what gender they are. And I find that fascinating. Fuck! I missed the Hunter's Torch. I'm smart. And good at video games. The ultimate fucking package. Social fucking warriors. Damn, that, sound, that sounds way more fun than social justice warriors, honestly. Is that like some sort of fucking cult where you guys you fight in the middle of the street because you're social and then afterwards you fuck? I'm down. My longest term GF was by and she didn't tell me for like six months. Did it change anything when she did? Okay. I'm gonna heal here just in fucking case. Smart and good at video games, Tola, will you marry me? Yeah. What's going on, Auriculum? How are you, man? Not at all. See, that's how I'd be. I'd just be like, okay, who gives a fuck? Most of the people I know that self-identify as bisexual are really bad at committing to anything. My three-year relationship just ended. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Hopefully it wasn't horrible. Hopefully it ended on a somewhat good note instead of being really fucking messy. What if I told you that Sif designed the Street Sharks? I'd believe it. I fuck. I sat here today and I'm just sitting here. I'm thinking I should take a nap. And my dog sits up and looks at me indicating that she wants to go. And I kind of make eye contact with her. And you know what she fucking does? Oh. <gasps> That's what she does. She fucking belches. And excuse me, I, I just had to emphasize the point. That wasn't a very good burp. Hers was better. She's better at belching than me. And it's just, my fucking dog is the least ladylike thing I've ever ever seen. She's pretty much a, uh, she's, she's pretty much 
Tumblr material. I think it's safe to say a lot of people on Twitch are saying, oh, I'm not. I had... I finally achieved one of my lifelong fucking goals yesterday. That's why I missed the stream. I became a member of a love dodecahedron. Nine Asian waifus approached me on the street and wanted me to be part of their love dodecahedron. I happily obliged, so I'm not single anymore. I shaman bone bladed the shit sharks and got the Rakuyo. Good shit. Okay. We're ready to fuck. The ba Okay, now we can change the title to what we're really doing. Permadeath torch only. Because fuck weapons. Weapons are for intelligent individuals, and I don't believe in those. When you're bi, if you date a person of the opposite sex, homosexual people yell at you that you're straight. If you date the same sex, straight people will yell that you're gay. That sounds fantastic. So just everyone fucking hates you, much like my real life. Very good. You're a fucking wizard, keep it that way. No, I'm a member of a love dodecahedron. Is your sister fire? No. I don't think her hair is red right now. What's going on, C3? How are you? Not too much is going on. We're just, uh, we're engaging in some belligerency. How are you, my friend? God, dude. We got a monumental damage increase. We went from, like, what? 68 to fucking 73 damage. Holy shit. Tolo's video game wizardry is due to his virginity. Never change your ass. You're right. I'm a fucking turbo version. King of the manlets. 510 cuck. Kissless, hugless, turbo virgin. That's me. I've really been in the stream just lurking for the past hour. A lot of topics covered in chat. Oh shit. That was a Diet Coke can collision. I apologize. My bad. Noise pollution. What's going on, Alva? Hope you've been well, man. What the fuck is a love dodecahedron? It's like a love triangle except ten sides instead of three. You are a level four pleb wizard who doesn't believe in leveling up yet. You right. Oh yeah, I didn't kill the fucking blood star beast yet. I'm smart. I'm not impressed so far. Could be way more shit talking. I'm polite. I'm a good boy. I don't shit talk. Is this actually? Yeah, this is actually a torch run. And if we die, we got to start all over. Rock and roll ain't noise pollution. I I try to keep like annoying ass fucking sounds to a minimum so i try not to talk a lot and i try not to have the diet coke can collection get rattled too much i hate to be the one that breaks this to you a dodecahedron is it really i could have sworn it was fucking 10 oh well i guess that, that just means i have to meet two more fucking asian women i'm i'm pretty happy about that let me let me Google just to make sure, because you might be right, but I've heard it used for tens. No, you're right. It's twelve. Whoops. See that? Ju that's my that's my Texan coming. That's a good thing that not too many people know what a dodecahedron is. Then, because I I just looked really fucking stupid. Just keep a mountain of aspartame capsules on your desk so you can knock that shit over on mic for the viewership numbers. Yeah, that'll be my sub alert. Whenever whenever anyone subs, I'll just slam my fucking face on my goddamn desk and rattle all of the Diet Coke cans. Deca is 10, but Dodecahedron is 12. Gotcha. What's going on, Quick Ben? How are you, man? I'm alright, player. Not too bad. How's it going? I'm... I'm doing pretty good. I'm my sleep schedule is absolutely fucked. I'm pretty fucking tired. But aside from that, I'm doing well. What's going on, Stakes? Is high. How are you? Sorry that I took so long. I'm stupid, as we've discussed with like the dodecahedron thing. I love riding a dildo while I strim. Yeah, strim in the dildo. Your sister is Adam, the father of. What the fuck? Yes. T-Dog. Imagine if the torch attacked the same... I don't want to imagine that. And I don't, I'm don't. i not sure how comfortable I am with you calling me T-Dog, Magic Man. Anyone else, I'd be alright. But just you? I don't know. Diet Coke is aspartame-free these days. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm gonna have to find something else to drink. The entire, the entire appeal is, like, punching holes in my brain. 
You're a pussy, why don't you get the chalice materials and add chalices to this run? Because if I do chalices, I'll do new game plus first. Classes are over, so you have no need for a sleep schedule, but I need to start consistently. I'm not I'm not a big fan of just like starting the stream at random hours of the day so nobody knows what the fuck is going on. Piercing rifle good for pairing. From what I've been told, no, but I haven't used it, so I have no first hand experience. Go find a woman that wants you for you. Well, well, we'll I'll get right on that. A single woman. Just stream 24 hours a day, okay. Fuck you. And fuck you. Yeah, bitch. Women are stupid and made to have sex with me. Yup. Wow. Torch is doing better damage than I expected. All these bitches out here have an agenda, damn. Can't trust any one of them. Alva, you, you're triggering me right now. I'm gonna write a Tumblr post about this. Tolo's soulmate is Rom. I'll imagine that. Come the fuck on. Tolo wants online. I would be watching Furious Pete. But he wasn't online. Furious Pete. What the fuck is Furious Pete? Oh my god, that fucking bug pisses me off so much. When you use an item too quickly after another item, your character just goes, Ugh! and doesn't fucking use it. He just looks at, looks at your, his hand and like shrugs. So fucking stupid. I cook for my women. Is your sister the orphan of cause? Yes. How the fuck are you gonna be orphan? Ludwig isn't a problem. I've beaten Ludwig level 4 torch. Ludwig's actually really easy if he doesn't one shot you, generally speaking. You don't know who Pete is? No. I don't I don't watch any internet personalities or TV personalities. Your soulmate is the living failures, magic man. Come on now. I know you wanna be my soulmate, but let's let's not get carried away. Holy fuck, I hate PSV. Mr. Plinkett. I know who Mr. Plinkett is, but that's about it. I'm sorry, I was racist towards Canadians. I meant a boo. A boo kid. Shit, come here, bitch. <laughs> Doing my first Bloodborne run, and I'm up to ROM, but I keep getting my dick ripped off. Just play... Play patiently. Pretend that... Just getting hit once will one-shot you because pretty much if you if you play aggressively, if you go and just try to hit Rom, you're gonna get gangbanged by like 70 little spiders and you're gonna waste all of your hard work. So just try not to cry, cry a lot when she shoots meteors, run around in a circle, and yeah, just hope for the best, man. Godspeed. He's the guy who eats for a living. Pete is just a buff dude who does eating challenges. So kind of like what I do except with eating. I think he got the better end of the deal. Can I be one of your 12 Asian waifus? No. Magic Man is getting friend zone hardcore. I rarely watch them, but him. I like to watch him down a massive dinner for four while I struggle downing a bowl of chips. I mean, I can eat... I can eat a lot despite being a fucking hungry skeleton. Just out of curiosity, is that BSB's back skin hanging over the face? Yes. He flayed his own back open and slurped it up. Delicious. As if you would be good enough for me? Yeah. Sup, Tolo, any advice for Maria? Um... Not really. Basically learn... Well, actually, I do have a little bit. For Phase 2 and Phase 3... Uh, the charge attack she does, don't be afraid of them. That, they're actually your best chance to do damage to her, because you can... 
if you learn how to dodge through them, you can dodge like behind her while she's swinging them and get it. And like she's down for long enough that you can get a backstab R two on her, and get a visceral. And there's there's very subtle visual cues if you're having trouble dodging. For the one where she does like a horizontal slash, she she kind of like twists the the end of her blade right before she lets off. So look at like the part of the sword that's behind her, and she'll move it a little bit. And once she starts moving it, that's your cue to dodge. And for the thrust, she kind of brings it closer to her chest. And when it's about to touch her chest, you dodge. It's the dodge timing for it. Should I be killing the spiders first? Yes, you should kill the spiders. If you if you just want like the consistent way to kill Rom, kill kill the spiders. And when Rom casts meteors, run in a circle around Rom, with Rom being the center of the circle. And GG, Rom is dead. Did you get the Beast Blood Nuggies? You're goddamn right I did. Force of habit, I suppose. Oh shit, that's actually doing a significant damage upgrade now. Unbelievable. But if you if you need like a visual aid, Scott Sun, bro, I have a video where I fight her if you want that. Where I dodge through. It'll, it'll show you how to dodge through and uh, get behind her for the backstabs. And just hit her right in the butt. What's going on, dude, Han? How are you, man? Dude, fuck Diet Pepsi. I need Diet Coke. You can set the dead BSB in the room. You can set the dead BSB in the room with the ritual blood on fire. Gotcha. That, that was just worded poorly. I understand. Magic Man is an independent wizard who don't need no Tolo. Kind of look like the Bloodstar Beast right leg. That's a very specific kind of look. I, I personally look like Vicar Amelia's left arm. <laughs> the fuck? Okay, we'll get the doll set and then we'll level up. I don't know if I want to level up bit or not. I kind of I kind of want to uh, level Arcane up so I can stun lock Amelia, hopefully. I don't think that'll happen, but she... Uh, a boy can dream. I quit drinking soda, it's bad for you. Of course it is, it's horrible for you, but it tastes good, so that is my excuse. I kinda, I'm kind of of a per, I'm the kind of person who just doesn't give a shit about what's good or bad. Unless it's like something that's just, like I don't go and just fucking snort asbestos or asbestos or whatever the fuck they're, I think it's asbestos, the, the shit that like creates microfibers in your fucking lungs and just straight up destroys your, your lungs. But for the most part, I'm kind of of a, I don't give a fuck, I'm gonna do what I wanna do, and consequences be damned. Cock? Are you kidding me? Yes. Diet cock is my favorite beverage. Absolutely delectable. I look like Orphan's Placenta. Well, I mean, better than Ludwig. Does anyone else sometimes trip while sitting down? Tolo, I heard you drink bleach. No, I actually drink Naruto in One Piece. What's the best non-DLC weapon? The Saw Spear. Coca-Cola. Look like Ludwig's big floppy foot dick. Big floppy foot dick, huh? You should make a permadeath kill everything run? No. The Street Sharks would end that run, Kubrick. Although I guess you haven't gotten to them yet. And the Axe guys in Hemlock Charnel Lane would probably end it a couple of times. What's going on, Ramza? How are you, man? You look like Mikolash's left testicle. What's what's the difference between the left and the right testicle, Magic Man? Please elaborate. Let's sell all this shit. We're rich as hell. We can sell the nuggies too. We, we can sell all the fire paper. We can sell everything. The left one hangs a little lower. Okay, seems like you guys are Mikolash testicle experts, so I'll, I'll trust you guys on this one. Against my better judgment. Okay. Five fucking damage increase. We're going for Vit. We're, we're stacking Vit. Do permadeath upside down playthrough? Okay, that sounds very riveting. And since I have a webcam, you'd be able to tell. 
I'm pretty happy though. Like today's been a good day because basically I found out that on Steam they're remaking the uh, the Turok Dinosaur Hunter games that are on the Nintendo 64. They have Turok Dinosaur Hunter on Steam and I bought that shit and I started playing it. Apparently they're porting the second one too. And, and it's kind of unbelievable because they're actually good ports. Like 60 FPS, the, the graphics are a bit better. It's, it's got native 69. It's not like, okay, we're going to port like a Nintendo 64 game and like... 5x5 five five resolution that takes up like one fucking percent of the screen and you have to download like 17 mods to get it to work properly. It just fucking works and it has good controls. And I'm, I'm pretty elated about that. Oh shit. Okay. I, I thought that was going to be worse than it was for a second. And then you get the optional fights. I think I'll fight Logarius next even though I'm a cheap fuck and I'm searching the nets how to get to them fucking bosses. Oh shit. Okay, that's what you were supposed to do, buddy. When's Christmas? I think next Friday, no? Are you actually asking when's Christmas? Do you not celebrate Christmas, dude? Are you are you one of those non-Christian individuals who celebrates like uh, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, or Saturnalia? Jokes on you, Saturnalia is actually Christmas. Are four kecks weak to, weak to fire? I think so. What's going on, Anuj? How are you? I think they're weaker to fire than they are lightning. So, yes. I just bought Battlefront. Good shit. When I was drinking soda, it was Diet Coke. That shit is addictive, but I was drinking so much and I was fucking my, with my liver. What was causing pain? Yeah, I've been there. I'm pretty pissed at my dog, too. Because she, she takes way too much of the bed now. She thinks she's entitled to, uh have like 90% of the bed so I'm huddled up in a corner and I actually decided to sleep like that and my elbow like my arm was folded like my 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 arm was folded kind of like I, it's hard to explain but my uh my my I don't know my fucking forearm and my bicep were like pressed against each other all night and I woke up and I, I swear to god it felt like I had arthritis it took like five minutes to get my elbow working again what element are SJWs weak to? They're not weak to anything. I just tripped while lying down. Damn, that feel. What's going on, Malicious Code? It's going pretty well. How are you doing? Apparently the Street Sharks are weak to blunt damage. Let's get the Street Sharks high as fuck. That's the weakness. Going to a restaurant on Christmas? Holy shit, dude gonna be fucking packed. What's going on, Alex Jack? How are you? Okay. Son of a bitch. They're weak to facts and dicks. No, they're not, actually. No. Because they'll just change the definition of words, fiery wyverns. So they're not, they're not weak to that shit at all. We were discussing this earlier, how if you if you use facts and dictionaries, they'll just change like the definition of words. Like in theory like that's a good idea in theory, but in practice it doesn't really hold any water. Hey, fuck these dogs. Not literally though. Orphan of Cause apparently isn't kin. I don't know. I think he's still weak to thrust damage, though. I'd say SJWs are weak to reality with Sally. That's not an element. They really aren't, though. Like, they're weak to nothing. Like, you can't defeat them with anything, because... It's just... They're gonna change definitions of words and believe what they want to believe. The only thing you can really do is just laugh at them, and that's what you should do. Because it, it, it makes them feel like they're, they're being marginalized, and that's, it makes them feel bad. So just laugh at that would be my advice. Lock on? Fuck no, dude. Locking on to dogs is a bad idea. Because if I need to roll in a specific direction, then locking on hinders me. Oh my god. <laughs> What's going on, Blind Guardian? Hello to you as well, Rage Huntara. Expecting an SJW nerf in the next patch. 
I don't know about that. I think I think SJW shit is just gonna get worse and worse as time goes on. I don't think it's going away anytime soon. God, it's so hard to kill these bitches. They they wind up their attacks so quick. I can't stun lock worth of shit. Actually, I, I I know how to stun lock. I mean, you just gotta you just gotta add bulls into the combo. There we go. That's that's thinking like a normal human being. Overwhelm them with national socialist rhetoric. Yeah, you're right. That was that was my uh, second suggestion. Okay. <laughs> that actually works. How's everyone today? I'm doing good. How are you, man? A fly just punched me in the throat. That doesn't sound very nice. That doesn't sound fun at all. We have three, but Corona sleeps in Guara's bed at night. Killian and Lola sleep in my bed every night, and I'm six foot two. See, my bed is small as fuck. My bed is tiny as shit. I'm getting a new one for Christmas. So... Soon there will be enough space for both me and the dude wing, but right now we are very, very pressed on space. Like, the thing that pisses me off is if I if I fuck off to the the far end of the bed, she, she just goes to the middle instead of staying on her side. She's just an absolute tyrant with the bedding. Using, using his skull mush? No. They'll get so triggered, words won't come out of their mouths. I have a fold-out futon that's barely bigger than me. And you let wiener dogs sleep with you. That sounds fucking horrible, man. Sif's a little bit bigger than a wiener dog, but... Nah, I think she's about a little less than two wiener dogs, though. I don't know how compact and polite your wieners are. And you're the first person to think I'm a female instead of a male? I, I don't know. I don't know about that. I don't I don't think I uh I don't think I said anything gender specific, but if I did it actually wasn't intentional. <laughs> Henwick Charnel Lane is what happens. Yeah, they're all female and they harvest the eyes of what I presume to be men. Cause I'm i I'm a fucking idiot. Oh shit. Okay. We gotta abandon, I think. We've got to abandon. Oh god. She's in the perfect zone for the Molotov no flex too. Fire! Oh shit. Can I please hit this one? Thank you, Jesus. I'm short as heck, I can sleep in almost any bed. I'm not that tall either, but my bed, like, I've literally had the same bed since I was a babbling. Sup, Tolo and Chad, just stopping in before going to see Star Wars. Have a good one. All right, Kami Cat, enjoy, enjoy your Star Wars movie. Thanks for stopping in and saying hi. I'm a grill. All right. Acknowledged. Is it just me or is Tatami out for blood? Tatami's a belligerent. Okay, I think I'm actually gonna kill them this time. What's going on, Nozemi? How are you? I, I almost said Nozemi, but I stopped myself at the last second. I can actually pronounce your name. Good for me. A babbling? Yeah. I mean, I was a strapping young babbling. I was just like, oh, wah! Oh, All the fucking time. Letting women put their foot down on anything literal cuck status, yeah. The most popular, yeah, I can't talk. Popular YouTube video in my country for 2015 is a disgusting, disgusting song. What? What is the disgusting song? Stop hit. Oh shit! Stop hitting the barrels, you fucking wench. Where the fuck are you? Are you actually invisible? Oh my god. The the witch was actually 100% invisible. I've never seen that before. Fucking Adventure Time and glitches with Tolomino's. What's going on, what up, cuck? I'm kind of offended that you didn't include me in, with the, uh, with the cucks. You should have said, what up, cucks, man. Oh, shit. Oh, no flex? Okay. 
This song is Friday by Rebecca Black. Stop doing that, you bitch. And Viz Strats? Yeah, I've never seen that before. Is anyone else? Also, what the fuck is that noise? Did you finish the Gratia run? No, it's it's postponed. We have Orphan and Lawrence left, and German, I guess. As well as the Moon present. Horrible woke up sick as fuck, so I'm gonna watch stream until I fall asleep again. Well, I hope you feel better. Hopefully watching my dumbass will forget the fact that you're very ill. I know it wouldn't make me forget it though, so probably no dice there. What's going on, S3? How are you, man? Friday is a great song, I agree, one of my favorites. The only the only thing I like more than Friday is Hot Girls We Have Problems too. We're just like you, except that we're hot. That's a fucking classic. Big fan of that song. <laughs> What's going on, Addy Loves? Oh shit. I keep finding the same one. Yeah, fuck you. Dumbass bitch. I cannot find the other one, holy shit. There we go. Have I told you, Tolo, I sold The Witcher 3 to buy Bloodborne. I'm proud of myself for that. Nice. Don't tell that to Golden Coin. He or uh, Witcher Goddess. He would trigger both of them. Damn. Keep falling down, lady. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. They hit hard. Little Doges. I want Doges. Doges are overrated. Mine wakes me up every fucking day. I have not had a full night's sleep without being woken up by my fucking doobling in months. It's not Bloodborne good, but it was a damn good game. I, I think it was good, too. I, I mean... Oh, hoo, hoo. wow. At least she knocked the fucking Snoop Dogg, Crystal Mary, Juana, Mountain Dorito Elemental out, too. Oh, God. Please blow up. Yeah, they can blow each other up, and it's pretty fucking funny when it happens. It's very helpful, too. What's going on, Game Universe? How are you? Okay, I actually have to ration my vials now. Witcher is better than BB Addy loves you. Triggering me, dog. Come on now. Hello, Bakuda. What's going on, man? Call her and be like, BB, I'm coming to see ya, like in the movies, that works one. Ba basically, my favorite pickup line is, A baby wants some fuck. That, that gets him every time, in my experience. Where the fuck? Okay. I think that one's at about 30% health, approximately. I'm not going to be able to tell them apart now, though. Pretty sure that's the one. No, we're... Yes, okay, good. Nothing can be overexposed to Shad Base. What the fuck, dude? I feel like a piece of shit for knowing what that is. Oh, shit. We did it. Tolo's best pickup line. Hey baby, you want some fuck? Yeah. Just saw Star Wars was really good. Good shit, man. Add me. I, I accept friend requests. My uh my things to low me are, but opening the uh the social thing crashes my stream, so I don't accept them until after the stream's over. Witcher three at some point gets more boring than having sex with the same dead body for the one thousandth time. Well, I don't know from experience, so I'll just have to take your word on that. Every character you meet in Witcher is a piece of shit who deserves to die, including the main character and his horse. Hold on, I have a, I have a Twitch message. This is important. Like how it gives me a uh, notification. Check this song out. Okay, Ramza, one day I will. Geralt is alpha. <laughs> what shad base? It's porn. It's very weird porn. Witcher series isn't really good as a game. 
I mean, I, I agree. I think the weakest part of it is certainly the gameplay, but a lot of people like the cinematic story experience more than the actual gameplay. What is going on, Fisher B? Damn, I really... Okay, I'm upgrading the wrong thing. Thank God, I'm retarded. So now we will fight Vicar Amelia, my favorite fucking boss in the game. But we have to actually go get Blood Vials first. And what's going on, 269? I, it's weird seeing that name in chat again. I sent you a message, yes. I, I know. You, you sent me an, a YouTube link that is probably just going to be degeneracy, but I will watch it at some point. I like women to be alive. What the fuck is wrong with you, Rainbow Okami? God. You're, you're against the meninist agenda, and I can't respect that. Hold on, I need to turn my AC on. Fucking hot as hell in here right now. Okay. Witcher 3 is better than Bloodborne, the Game Awards told me, so yeah, you're right. Happy to say I platinum BB yesterday. Congrats, man. Good shit. Witcher 3 is a great game. I think if you're talking gameplay wise, I don't see. Anything coming out ahead over Bloodborne, but that's my opinion. If you want a movie game, play something like Uncharted. I fucking hate movie games, personally. This is the kind of game I like. I love the gameplay in Witcher. I also love the gameplay in BB. You can only like one or the other, Seb. What the fuck? Sip drinking that water. Yeah, she's she's slurping. How's Fallout 4? I have no idea. I'm a weirdo. I like talking to girls about their butts. Well, I mean, that is kind of weird, but it, as long as you can find girls willing to discuss that subject with you, I, don't, I fail to see a problem. Okay. Wait, is there a dog following me? Of course there is. Why wouldn't there be? Fucking doogies. Okay. You should play Bayonetta. I should play a lot of things. I think if I play anything new on stream within like the next month or so, it'll probably be Xenoblade. But I don't know, I've heard that game is shit for streaming. Like it's boring to watch. Are you going to let cinematic clips play? Probably not. Most girls don't mind talking about their butts. I often compliment ladies that I'm close with on the quality of their butts. Fantastic. Just such, such a playboy, Dongo. What's going on, Bacon man? How are you? <clears throat> Excuse me. They're talking about fucking dead women. I think only one person is talking about that. Oh shit, oh shit. Tolo, let me time spoilers out. Yeah, if you post Star Wars spoilers, I, I give Anuge permission to time you out. Too close to being a wizard to throw away the capability of infinite cosmic power. See, that's the spirit. That's what, really what you, you gotta tell yourself at the end of the day to make it all better. Oh god. I fucking hate these things. But I need them for the blood vials. Fighting two of these at once is annoying as hell. Oh shit, what's going on Chiliax? How are you, man? Most girls would much rather discuss their tits. Sometimes butts are an uncomfortable subject for a woman. Well, I'll take your word for it. Okay. What kind of degenerate women do you talk to? <laughs> this torch only run is... I'm, I'm really... I'm really respecting the damage output. Output. The, the damage output. I got tickets for tomorrow too. If you become a wizard, can you send me some back in? T can you send me back in time so I tell my old set self not to have sex so I can become a wizard? Sure.
Oh no! <laughs> All of that is uncomfortable. <laughs> oh shit, no, no. I need more stimmy so I can swing more with the torch. Oh shit. Why are you why are you using that attack? Are you are you retard? Damage output is pretty sweet. I have a plus five, so no, it really isn't. <laughs> it it really uh <clears throat> really is not living up to expectations. I was expecting like a top DPS weapon. What's going on, Echo 3? How are you? I have nipples, three nipples to be exact. The torch flame should have a lingering burn. That'd be interesting. Please euthanize me, I'm a genetic freak. Damn. Okay, let's go spend our insight. Because if we have too much insight, Vicar Amelia might start creating new moves from, and bringing her phase two moves into phase one. And we wouldn't want that. Okay. Holy fuck, dude. This damage output, or rather lack of damage output, is just upsetting. But, I don't really know what I expected. Let's go die to Vicar Amelia. I can't remember if I got the shortcut. I guess we'll find out. Some of us have boobies. What's it like to have boobies in Nuge? Am I the only person who doesn't find women's buttholes that attractive? Is it weird if I find one of my testicles is bigger than the other two? No. Technically, everyone can be a genetic freak. Depends on what you find gross or freakish. I have eight nipples and a tail coming to think about it. Are you really coming while thinking about it, Kubrick? Come on now. But boobies have nipples on them? No, only some of them. Mannequins have boobies and they don't have nipples, so you gotta make sure to consider their feelings, 269. Okay, I did. I was about to be pissed. Tolomeo is a genetic freak. I am. I have pectus. I have scoliosis. Um, I probably have other shit that I don't know about. Thought boobies were literal bags of sand. Is this not true? No, it's true. I miss this crazy chat. Stationary sex. Yeah, I love having sex with stationary. Just really, I, like, the feeling of getting a paper cut on your wiener is just... Nothing can beat it. Grammar Nazi Tolomeo, that's me. I find it funny that Tolo only answers the one about the three testicles and not the butthole. What about the butthole? Stationary sex? Yeah, sex with, like, a, like writing stationary. You know what I mean? You, am I the only one? Damn. Oh, I'm bad. I'm fucking shit at this game at all, and and the whiff. Holy fuck! This is gonna be this is gonna be trouble. Is it wrong that this chat reminds me of 4chan? No, they, that comparison has been made quite frequently. What the fuck are you doing, bitch? Damn, I tried to hit her head and it did not work. Damage output is fucking sweet. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, big boy. What's 4chan? It's a mystery. That's where the bad people are on the internet. <laughs> Do you buy Dark Souls 3? I'm getting Dark Souls 3. I don't have it now. I'm not I'm not a big fan of pre-ordering shit. Come on, I want you to jump so I can stagger your head. By stagger your head, I mean miss your head. I really don't want to stagger your legs until that one phase, that 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 phase two thing. <laughs> 
Why are all bosses in Bloodborne women or transvestites? That's that's the real question. I've been wondering that for a long time myself. At least I can hit wherever the fuck I want. Like if I if I aim for a certain part, it's very easy to hit it considering it's just a fucking thrust forward. Nice phase two. I heard he's a system admin. 4chan is fucked Instagram. Are you, are you really gonna say that 4chan is fucked Instagram? Isn't Instagram like two years old or some shit? 4chan is the internet system admin hack chasing through the lows. That's true. Many girls in the U.S. say kiss my butt like it's a humiliating thing. If a girl would say that to me, I would answer gladly. Fantastic. Thank you for sharing with the rest of the class. What is going on, Golden Boy? How are you, man? How's work been? How's life? How's liberty? How's the pursuit of happiness, my friend? We are gonna go do, uh, Kanehurst now. No, don't tell me to shut my eyes. Bitch, I don't want you to touch me. Fuck. This harlot thinks I'm just gonna shut my eyes for her. I'm fucking real. I toss salad like someone's paying me to. Fantastic, Petra, please. What's going on, man? It's been a while. Degenerates, look away for a second. I, it was actually a pretty fucking good Vicar Amelia kill. I actually did not break her legs before I intended to, which is unusual for me. I'm a model citizen friend. I am the ideal, I promise. Work been okay, usual stuff. Well, as long as it's not horrible, you know. Are you excited for the holiday season? Sif yodel for me? She won't. Not yet. I had a lore idea? Shoot. Like, I'll, I'll read it and I'll consider it, but I don't know shit about the lore, so it'll be lost on my dumb ass. You can sell blood cocktails? I can, but it, I get, like, a fucking pittance for them now. And no, I, I understand what you mean by souls. I call them that, too. You snap in at the doll out of nowhere, you going through a dry spell? I don't know, you were the one trying to seduce me yesterday, so no. I'm not the one having the dry spell, apparently. Or maybe, maybe we're both, uh, maybe we both need some Gatorade. We need to make a trip to the convenience store and get hydrated. What is going on, White Husky? How are you, my man? You really should be killing the doll. Vanilla doll would not agree with that. If you break her legs, she can't say no to anal, damn. You know, from experience. Isn't Skyrim coming out on PS4? I thought it was. Is it not? What if Old Yarn and Burning Down has a lot to do with why Lawrence is on fire? We know the Keepers ha all have the ability to control fire. Well, I would. S I don't know too much aside from the fact that the, uh, like, the first part of the DLC, those little fucking hippie fedora neckbeard beasts that are all fuzzy and shit, the ones in Old Yarnum are present there, so, maybe, maybe there is a connection, but I don't, I don't know what the fuck it would be. All goods, good shit, man, glad to hear it. How many twin stone shards do I need? I need all of them. Fantastic. Fear equals fuck everything and run. Is that really what it means, Papa Dap? This is getting out of hand. Excuse my language. Get what she can't deal. She offers more direct contact. Wow, holy shit. <laughs> you're, you're really getting into this idea, Kubrick. Getting a little too hyphy right now. Do not suffer the doll to live. <laughs> hey, I don't have to get the beast blood nuggets here. I hear BB is getting a PSP. I'm really, I'm really waiting for the Neo Geo Game Shark bundle for Bloodborne so I can finally beat the Celtic Beast with the Moon Jump code. Perhaps someone will even make a code where I can play as Ludwig so I can finally fulfill my deepest brony fantasies. Have you not played Fear yet? No, I haven't. Be my fourth Tim buying Skyrim. At least it's not your fifth, Fred, dude. I'm on. I'm on the seventh, Steve, buying Skyrim, and it's just it's a fucking it's a lot of work. Fourth Tim. How many Tims do you have? <laughs> Damn. 
And in some parts, Tolo under extreme dipping is the what? What the fuck are you talking about? I'm very lost right now. And in some parts, Tolo under extreme, yeah, dipping is the true strat. Like dang souls. That feel when you only have... I had one Tim, and he was one of my best friends. Now he doesn't talk to me anymore. I miss my one Tim. That feel. It's like, I'll hit him up every once in a while. He's like, yo, Tim, man, it's been forever. How you doing? How are the wife and kids? And he won't say anything back. I'm just like, damn, dude, that feel. That feel with no Tim boy pussy. That got out of hand. What got out of hand? Need more Tims, yeah. I'm thinking of making a tin factory. Time to go do some research. Can't flim flam the tin tan. <laughs> God damn it. I only have two Steves. Okay, so let's get the rest of our shards and then we'll go to Kanehurst. We're not going to be fighting Logarius until we plus 10 this bad boy though. Oh shit, I'm stupid. I shouldn't try to run by that guy. I honestly bought Tomb Raider three tins. I bought Dark Souls three tins. Actually, I think I bought it four because I gifted it to someone on Steam, I think. So four tins. Thank you, Western Decadence, for your cultural gift. Yup. I was lost in Forbidden Woods. Oh shit. I can't believe I've done this. And accidentally went into a snake pit and got wrecked. That, that feel. They they really need to put some more signs so you don't accidentally make that mistake. That's one of the things this game really lacks. Is it breaks my immersion and it makes me feel like a bad gamer when I, when I don't know what's coming. And I'm not just talking about myself. I mean, like, I'm talking about there needs to be signs indicating that there's danger ahead. There needs to be an arrow pointing me to where I need to go at all times. Otherwise, you just can't enjoy the game. What does boycott mean? It means fuck you. I'm not buying any of your shit. Like, if if my name's the Banana Republic and I release, like, the winner banana hammock and a bunch of, like, uh, a bunch of people who are homophobic decide this banana hammock thing is not Christian, it's not even Zoroastrian, then they would stop buying from Banana Republic, and that would be a boycott. Sif Awu when approximately five hours from now. Watch out, fucking Snape Pit down to your left, Snape Pit. Don't know if trolling. I'm always serious, I never joke. I'm nothing if not for real, and I'm for real friends. You can look me up on Fur Affinity. So we'll get Kanehurst summons, and then we'll go on a goodie expedition to get all the Easter eggs and sell them for maximum shekels. And then we will be able to level up immensely. I bought TR and then Square Enix fucked me over with the Xbox timed exclusive bullshit, damn. Snape Pit kills Tolo Door. Do I have to sub to have Tolo emotes? Yes. Let me go to sleep. Alright, Roy, take it easy. Have a good night, man. Okay, so. Let's just mosey our way on through this fucking hellhole, not die to the brain sucker, and hopefully everything will be okay. Would you date a girl that wanted to travel to Yarnum? No. The only if <clears throat> the only girl I would date who played Bloodborne has to be able to replicate the Celtic Beast scream. Like when you're climbing up the ladder for the first time, I need to like when I finally lose my turbo virginity, I need to have her make that Celtic Beast yodel, or it just will not be the complete experience for me. Tolo is sell out just JK. You don't have to add just JK there. I'm not gonna be like, fuck you, 269. You hurt my fucking feelings. And ban you or anything like that. Maybe we'd have to kill a dozen beasts and have an orgy with their blood. Tolo shills for Totina's pizza rolls. Yup, that's me. Tolo, you fucking sell out. Yup. That's me. I sold out so hard, dude. I'm I'm getting sponsored by uh what is that website called? Gold mine. I finally decided that I can make massive income by putting a gold mine on my uh, channel description. Brain sucker scree is the sexiest sound in BB. No. 
What's going on, Dr. Kyokushin? How are you, man? You're too wild for Yarnum. He Anuj is weird. Like sometimes he's very well behaved, then sometimes he gets uh he gets frustrated. He, he gets a little he gets a little raunchy. Anuj the raunchy Indian. Am I real now? No, you're still false. Sponsored by G2A, yeah. Just say make sure make sure you buy video games with the with fucking the promo code CUCKSHED to get like a fucking half a percent discount and I can get some of that. Spread some of the butter over my way. The must have for any professor gamer, that's me. Uptime, I don't believe in robots, but an hour and a half. Grats on 4k follows, thank you. No audible. <laughs> I'm not getting sponsored by anyone, don't worry. Any, any, like, potential sponsor would come into my fucking chat and hear me talking about, like, shekels and, uh, like, reading out the comments about worshipping the female butt and just be like, no, we can't, we can't touch this with a 17-foot pull. Plus, even, even if they would, I don't have the numbers anyways. And even if I did have the numbers, I would probably politely decline, unless it was something that was legitimately good. Tolo sponsored by Twin Cave in. Like, I, I would absolutely shill for Diet Coke. Because I already do that. But if someone's like, yo, dog, dude, this this green man gaming shit, I'm going to be like, no. Uh-uh. Call of Duty African American Ops 3. Yeah, I am. How did you find out my secret, 269? You should apply for NASA sponsorship. Oh, yeah, dude. Absolutely. I can see myself getting that. Okay, watch the combo. Oh, shit. I always underestimate how much reach they have with that shit. What are we, the Grinch? Flash forward to a few months when Tolo's doing boot box on openings. Yeah, dude. The fucking boot crate, the Japan crate. Make sure to buy Japan crate with this code, Tolo Cuck Shed, so you can get a bunch of worthless fucking knockoff brands of Japan to make candy. Fan fucking tastic. Why you accept sponsorship by J List? <laughs> Are you not under leveled? I'm not going to fight Logarius. I'm going to get all of the uh, upgrade materials and shit to sell in Kanehurst, dude. And I'm not fighting Logarius. I could if I wanted to, I think, but I'm, I don't really want to yet. Because you can get roughly 110 echoes in sales you can be a door-to-door -door salesman get some i uh, get some cut co cutlery and sell that shit for massive money six digit salary with cut co cutlery why are you a giant cuck i was born that way that's what lady gaga taught me she gets sponsored by fromsoft yeah that's happening sponsored by doritos and mountain dew because he has this world's out of this world swag mlg we all know the only true sponsorship Tolo could get was from Ask Lee Madison. Is that like Ask.com bought out Ashley Madison or some shit? What the fuck? Cuck Coke out, clearly. I like that, actually. I like this castle. I like the castle, but I hate everything in it. I have to go to work. Alright, 269, take it easy, my man. Have a good one. I need a massage. You sound like a Totino spokesperson. I fucking hate pizza rolls. The only thing I'll say is they're good value for the money. Like, you get a lot of food buying those things, but that's because they're pretty much just bread with, like, one thing of fucking sauce and pepperoni. I bought triple pepperoni Totino's pizza rolls, and I was sorely disappointed. They're, they're absolutely indiscernible from a normal pizza roll. They're the exact same thing. That's spelling with a 107 fever. That's, that's what that is. I, I like making fo don't take any on bridge with me doing that. I, I just like being a fucking idiot and reading out typos. <laughs> Total like cinnamon rolls, pop adapt, come on. And I, I don't wanna see that fairy bread link tonight. I don't wanna see any fairy bread in my chat tonight. 
107, you would be in the hospital. Yeah, if, if you if you actually have a 107 fever, you might want to go get that checked out. Just a, a friendly suggestion from a cock. <laughs> Every Japanese mansion is just a Resident Evil 1. I haven't even played Resident Evil 1 or 2 or 3 or 4. I played 5, unfortunately. Oh shit. Absolutely triggered. You don't like cinnamon, cinnamon rolls. I'm fucking smart. Cinnamon rolls here on American. Like, I, I'm good at pronouncing fucking Paschetti and Cinnamon. My favorite meal, by the way, is Paschetti and Cinnamon. Play remake, it's good as I have like a laundry list of games I need to play. Like frozen cinnamon pop tarts. You're a degenerate for liking that. Pretty sure brain damage starts at 105. Wow. Might want to go and get checked out if you're at 107, just saying. I want to try out Twinkies. No, you don't. That's that's a slippery slope, no I mean first year like one minute you're eating a fucking Twinkie and then you're in Walmart in a fucking scooter. It's just, you do not want to go down that route. That is a life choice you cannot take back. I think I'm gonna buy two cheeseburgers, but it's only 9.45 a.m. Nothing sells burgers. Damn, if only you lived in fucking Texas and you could go to Whataburger. They sell that shit 24 hours a day. <laughs> Don't like any other flavor than nacho cheese. I fucking hate Doritos. Just with one Twinkie? Yeah. It's, it's like drugs, basically, except they're legal. I wish this shit had a uh, gem slot. Tries Twinkle or Twinkie. I'm stupid. Equals in Walmart riding scooter. Fucking. I mean, yeah, that's what happens, man. America is suffering from the Twinkie Plague. Talk to me about burgers. Well, burgers are very fucking good, and I occasionally enjoy them. Steak's still better, though. Did you know Doritos dust is purposefully put there for the Doritos experience? Don't talk shit about the Doritos experience, Blind Guardian. <sighs> Fuck. They actually think that making your fingers dirty is a pleasant experience. It is. Every time I come to Tolo stream, I get hungry because you guys start talking about Whataburger and steaks. Good. Good morning, Tolo. How are you? I'm doing all right. How are you doing, Matrix? Hope you're doing well. You're about to be doing really shit. We're, we, we've moved on from the gun run to permadeath torch only. Because fuck myself. Do you have steam? I do. Steak or burgers of this shit. I, funnily enough, I like steak and I like burgers, but I've never had a steak burger. Oh shit, I almost ran off. That would have been bad. Okay. Now we'll go sell that shit and level up. We're gonna level up. Sound is off. Don't trigger me, Dongo. Don't, don't trigger. Is the sound actually off? I'm pretty sure... He the Kappa means no, but it, he, he triggered me. Can we add you on Steam? No. What's going on, Evolve Enigma? How are you and the pooch doing? Ever had Wild Burger? No. Steam is like my refuge where I can just, like, I get, if I'm like on my own time playing a game, like I'm playing Turok and people start messaging me on Steam, I literally get triggered. I, I do not like being messaged when I am uh, doing my own thing, so I don't I don't give out my steam. Sorry, sorry, not sorry. No sound is fine. God damn it. <laughs> Excuse me. So that's why you go to Kanehurst. Look at my echoes. That's fair enough, yeah. Like, I... Like I was saying yesterday, or not yesterday, the day before, I'm, I'm not antisocial, but I need, like, an excessive amount of time to just, like, not have to deal with people. So, Steam is my fucking pillow for it, basically. Doing excellent, man. Finished my last final today. Pup is having doogie dreams. That's fantastic. I hope you did well on your finals. 
Fuck, I still don't have all my shards. Praise the sun, there's no gun to be seen, but you get the torch instead. Perusing the shelves at the supermarket, I found caramel apple flavor tea from Celestial Seasonings. I took it home and brewed myself a batch. It tasted like caramel apple lollipops. It, it was terrible. Don't know what I was expecting. You didn't level up, I know. I'm, get, I'm making sure that I level up my weapons so I have enough echoes for shadows. I'm trying to think of my order of operations that I want to do here. I'm not sure if I want to uh, just proceed through the main game and then do all the optional bosses at the end or what. I guess that's what I will do. I'm actually kind of nervous about shadows. Didn't even regen. I I'm getting the shard and I'm going back. Just everyone clam the fuck down, please. It's gonna be okay. Drop the fucking gun! Most people have sexual fantasies. I fantasize about burgers. Fucking boy, because he didn't level up. I am very well aware. I only see four Whataburgers in the U.S. There's more than four. There's like, I could go, I could, like, find four of them within ten miles, Kubrick. Three of them in Texas. That's not accurate. That's not accurate at all. It's because you're an introverted vile blood. I'm not a vile blood. I don't even kill people. Level, oh my god, I'm so triggered right now. <laughs> you live in Austin? No, I live in DFW. The only reason I would ever want to live in Austin is Barton Springs. And I guess the fact that it's probably a more interesting city than DFW. Level up? No. I'm about to just not level up just to spite you guys. TFW? No, DFW. Dallas Fort Worth. I like it here. I, I like San Antonio more, though. I grew up in San Antonio. Big fan of that place, but. Yeah, if, if I accidentally fucked up and said TFW, my bad. I, I'm really bad at, like, talking. I'm not. I never learned how to do that whole thing. Wait, it doesn't increase my attack at all. Fuck, okay. Might be going to school there soon. It's it's good in some ways. It's, it, there's like not a whole lot of shit to do, but the food's really good. Like there are a lot of good restaurants, but that's about it. And the aquarium is all right. Love that zoo and the Mexican... I actually like the San Antonio Zoo more personally, but the aquarium here, I'll take it back. The aquarium here is pretty god tier. I'm I'm a big... I'm a big, uh... Nerd for fucking aquariums, and I really like the DFW one. They got, like, the, uh, the giant catfish. They've got the arapaimas. They've got manatees. They've got all sorts of... Fun. And they have a jaguar, my favorite aquatic animal. You want to see this? Sh I'm not. I'm. I swear you were gonna get banned if I clicked this in this fairy bread. Okay, I, I. I would not have put it past you to upload it with a different URL. That looks horrible, by the way. I don't. I don't like the way that looks at all. Grew up in San Antonio too. Yeah, I loved it there. I loved the Riverwalk. I loved multiple of the restaurants. When I was a kid, I loved SeaWorld, but not so much anymore after watching African American Fish. Plus, like, we went to SeaWorld this year, and all of their shows are, like, propaganda to counter the African American Fish, I guess, film. I'm searching your house in Google Maps. Nice. Good luck. I was tempted. Are you killing Fire Cleric Beast? Yes, I am, but for Fire Cleric Beast and Defiled Watchdog, if I get that far, I will be using Rosemarinus as my alternate weapon, because I'm not going to be able to kill them with a torch, obviously. Okay, but that's if we get that far. I actually... The damage was worse than I was expecting. Or is worse. I guess it was is not the right way to talk. They need to add new loading items, or items in the loading screen, it's getting boring, I don't know, I don't even, maybe it's boring for you, but I just look at the chat during loading screens, I like it. <laughs> I like the fries, 
pop it that also I'm pissed though like why are there only like five fucking french fries uh, on that meal on that plate that, that legitimately triggers me I do not like that oh f fuck you Charles fucking stupid ass oink oink Well, we got one vial out of that. Guess I can't complain too hard. And we have Yosefka, so if we need that, we can use it. Let's see how horrible this ends up being. I actually should probably go kill Ludwig at some point. Oh, my torch is in plus 10, so my damage would be reprehensible. You know what? My damage actually is in complete dog shit. It's not good, but it's not dog shit. I like the Demon Souls loading screens. Yeah, I like the, the character portraits and shit. That was pretty cool. <laughs> Fuck the oink oinks. This Nicki Minaj and Dream Girl now. Now I'm writing cheeseburger on Google and I'm jerking off to the pics. Thank you for sharing with the rest of the class. Nicki Minaj is 90% plastic? Yeah. I don't know. Not a big fan. <laughs> Nicki Minaj built like a bumblebee. I'm not sure if that's supposed to be meant as like a compliment or not. I'm sexually attracted to bumblebees. <laughs> God fucking damn it. I think I should top off just in case. <laughs> oh shit. No. Fave Grill is, is Fem Shepherd. That can look like anything. Or am I, or am I retarded? Is there like a canon way that looks? Tolo and Shadows are my I still don't know what an OTP is. I imagine it's some Wea Bibble shit. God damn, actually I changed my mind. My damage is fucking atrocious. This weapon needs a buff for sure. Can you teach us how to make love? Yeah, you just gotta go up to him and you gotta go. Mm. Oh shit, that was bad. Okay, well we'll just kill you instead, I guess. That works out. Killing them in this order a lot recently is kind of weird. Oh shit. I'm dead. Nope. Not quite. Okay. 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 Now I just gotta play patiently. Actually, like with two with two noodle arm guys, I can't be reading chat. So I give me a second. I actually have to focus pretty substantially. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Please no snakes. Okay. OTP equals orgasmic teddy porn. Very good. You can hear their orgasms. Google Maps came back to reality, and geez, you guys have a lot of fucking Whataburgers. That's because it's delicious. BRB din din. So that's how you make love. You just gotta run up to him and poke him with your torch. Made it this far? Yeah, this isn't particularly far though. The, the worst is yet to come. Like, I'm not looking forward to One Reborn. That is the one that's kind of giving me the Jimmy shakes right now. I also need blood vials. I might have to make an expedition to Central Yodel. 
Also, it's really annoying the lack of stun lock on this shit. Dallas is a Whataburger in almost every corner. There really is. Like, I live in a square of Whataburgers, basically. How powerful can Torch get? Reasonably powerful. Getting rustled? Yes. It's never, like, on par with a real weapon. Don't get me wrong, but it ends up doing, like, two or 300 damage a hit with full arcane, I think. Can you throw oil? I can, but I'm not going to. Oil is expensive to get in abundance. Okay, so now we'll go get some vials and central yarn them after leveling up here. I don't- I think I'm beyond the point of, uh, getting any meaningful damage from Arcane. We'll have to see. Putin made anime real just saying that's true. That's what that's what Putin did. That's what he's going down in the history books for, and I'll always respect him for that, but it's just not enough for me. You gotta have more than that to get my vote for president of the United States. <laughs> Conviction. I've read the books and all she can think is wanting- who is- oh, what the fuck? Oh, you're talking about Game of Thrones. I don't know shit about Game of Thrones. I'm pretty sure that makes me like a terrorist in the United States of America, too. Hold on. Okay, for a second I thought I haven't been upgrading my torch. I'm just making sure. Game of Thrones, yeah. I, I've never watched or read Game of Thrones. I guess I don't. you don't read Game of Thrones, you read A Song of Ice and Fire, or whatever the fuck it's called. Oh shit. There we go. These fucking moans they make. I've never read Game of Thrones. Yeah, yeah, I corrected myself. You were OG, what do you mean? I'm not, I'm not really. I'm not even a gangster. I can't even be an original gangster if I'm not a gangster to begin with. Reading, yeah, I agree. If you read, you're a degenerate. Reading is what's wrong with today's society. We should be making fucking gun, like, shooting ranges and, like, shooting people instead of reading. Like, reading is un-American, to be honest. I'm pretty sure if George Washington came back from the dead, he would be absolutely appalled with how much we read as a country. It's stupid fucking streaming games instead of a normal game, so I can't take screenshot. Oh shit. Oh, mama. I'll be back. Alright, Anuj. Take it easy. Okay, so we got our vials. Now we can do ramen manual. Oh shit, no, actually our controller is just gonna make us sit down and die to birds. I'm calling it, that's what's gonna kill us this run. It's the motion controls on the controller are gonna fuck us. You can always read an audiobook. That's usually what I do if I wanna read something. I, I just, I do not like the physical act of reading a book, like being hunched over and shit. I, I would not be opposed to reading or like listening to an audiobook while playing the Bijima games. Is it true that dumb girls are hotter? I don't know. I don't think appear like physical attractiveness has anything to do with intelligence. But that being said, I don't know. I'm not sure if I want to say this. I got to be PC. I don't know. Just from what I've seen, this might sound like a piece of shit thing to say or uninformed or whatever. I can imagine this is going you know, to rub people the wrong way. But from what I've seen, the shittiest lot you can be dealt in life is being an ugly chick. So, if you're an ugly chick, people treat you like shit, dude. Like, you you were not treated like a human being. At least, a lot of them, a lot of people will just not respect you if you're, if you're an ugly woman. So, you, you kind of have to find a way to have something else. Like, you, you have to make up for that. You know what I mean? So, I feel like ugly chicks are more likely to better themselves and get... Like, become more educated, well-read, whatever the fuck. Become more... Like, actually learn skills more than someone who is of normal attractiveness, I guess. 
What's going on, Zodi and Lucario? How are you? That's just me being a fucking idiot, though. Like, that might not actually have any basis in reality. That's just kind of what I think. Is it true that dumb guys are hotter? Um... Maybe, like, that probably applies to both genders to some degree. But... It's just, it's much, like, I will, I will say, like, despite me being against, like, fucking SJW feminism shit, as a woman, you generally are, ex like, a lot more is placed on how you look than if you're a man. Do you get respect as an ugly guy? So, like, ugly guys can get respect by being status symbols and shit. Like, there are plenty of, like, ugly Twitch streamers, ugly celebrities. Like, you're much more likely to see, like, an ugly celebrity male than an ugly celebrity female. I think that's a pretty good example of what I'm talking about, I guess. What's going on, Sweater Kittens? How are you? Back? Holy shit, that was quick, Papa Dap. What the fuck? <laughs> it's not like ugly women can't work on having a hot body, though. I mean, yeah, but at the same time, like, I... I don't- I actually care most about the face, personally. That's true to an extent. No, that- that was my unplit- my- my, my non-PC answer. Is that, generally speaking, ugly people are treated like shit, especially women. And so, if you're treated like shit, and you're, like, treated as lesser as a result of your- your looks, that kind of encourages you to develop strong personality or traits outside of how you look because attractive people do have it easier they're just treated better in general i always hear i have a beautiful personality now i know i'm just ugly i don't know i think you're kind of cute knows them i do but a lot don't like lena dunhammer amy schumer like the first not incredibly beautiful so that's what i'm saying like most female celebrities are they're pretty much all fucking hot like, gorgeous, hot, whatever the fuck. There's very few ugly, famous chicks, basically. Especially in, like, Hollywood. But you can name a fuck ton of really ugly dudes. If I moved to the U.S., do you think I could work at a Whataburger? Maybe. I'm painfully average, me too. I'm, I'm just an average fuck. I'm, I'm neither attractive nor hideous. top of my head so those are the ones I don't even know any names oh shit the spiders just landed on me fuck okay 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 nope 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 jack black jack african american don't be racist come on now what is going on Fuju how are you Oprah <laughs> I mean I, I suppose that's true, but at the same, like, I don't know. You're right. That's all I can say. I'm just saying it seems to be less common. Holy shit, how's the life of BB and your partnership treating me? It's going okay, I guess. How are you doing, Demon's Blood? I hate women who do too much makeup. It is a strong word, man. A good sense of humor gives men and women an edge in attractiveness, for sure. For some people. For some people. There's just legitimately people who don't like to fucking laugh, though. Like, that sounds weird, but I've, I've met them. You know, watch Star Wars? I don't know, maybe. Come back from getting food in this vacuous bitches on my screen? Yeah. See, Rama is an example of an ugly woman not getting any love. I hate laughing. Me too, dude. It's just the worst shit. Like, when someone comes and says a fucking joke to me, I'm just like... I, I don't even know what to say. Like, the degenerates. Trying to force a fucking emotion out of me. No, I'm not even joking, though. Like, they're, they're legit people. Like, maybe they, they don't explicitly hate it, but you would think so. You know, they just have zero sense of humor. They do not enjoy jokes in any fucking capacity. They never try to make jokes. It's like... 
I don't know, that's my least favorite kind of person. Why don't you lock on, because not locking on gives me more freedom to aim and more freedom to control where I'm going. I lock on for some fights, but this is not a fight where I think locking on is a good idea. Because, like, if I'm not locked on... Here, let me show you. Let me show you the general gist of what I'm talking. If I'm not locked on, right? I can sit here and attack this spider while still looking at what Rom is doing. So if it starts casting pig and sorcery, I know to run the fuck away. What's going on, Extremis? How are you? I'm doing good, and not too much is happening. I hope you're doing well. hope you're ready for the fucking holiday cock season. If you're sick, do you gotta tell Twitch you won't be streaming? No, I don't have any obligation to Twitch. Basically, I can do whatever the fuck I want. They, they don't say that you have to stream a certain amount of hours or anything like that. Like, you could, like, I could literally stop streaming right fucking now, and if people decided to keep, uh, like, keep their subscription, I, w I would not be punished in any way, and people could still subscribe if I didn't stream for, like, three months. I'm not gonna do that, obviously, but I, I, there's no, like, minimum amount of work or anything I have to do. It's pretty nice. For how long am I streaming? Probably a while. Like ten different kinds of laughing. I fucking love laughing, dude. I wheeze like a six year old. I love laughing too. I just I just I don't know. I only laugh at really, really stupid shit. Favorite type of person is hot grill person. Oh shit. I've been known to inject raw moon sugar into my bloodstream. My cat Skooma would like to have a word with you. Tolo's one of those gangsters that tries to look badass and suppress a laugh at the same time. And ends up making- no, I, I don't. Like, whenever whenever I actually la want to laugh, I laugh freely. It's just- I don't know. Like, the time when uh, I first played through the DLC and I found the Ludwig face, the Ludwig head that made the fucking horse noises, I was laughing for like five minutes straight. What's going on, Lamb and OJ? How are you guys doing? And Mad Friends as well. Torch seems crazy? Yeah, Torch is pretty belligerent for sure. Oh shit. I should run when the meteors are being cast. People don't laugh or boring yet. Did you highlight that? No. I highlighted the playthrough, but not the particular moment. Do you watch Flash or Arrow? No. What's going on, Dalo? Not much is happening here. How have you been, my man? Feel female comedians are the I just, I actually, like, at the risk of getting some shit, I've never particularly enjoyed any stand-up comedy that I've watched. Granted, I haven't watched a whole hell of a lot. Just not my my preferred type of medium. I like stupid fucking internet memes, I guess. Playing BB like always, how's it going? It's going well. Hungry, tired, bored, and fucking thirsty, but I, aside from that, I'm doing good. <laughs> I'm kinda hungry, though. Shouldn't have eaten all of my pizza. Bill Burr is pre I've never watched Bill Burr. I just don't like stand-up comedian shit, I guess. How's school been going? It, it went well. I'm done with finals, so... I'm just fucking off now. Oh, fuck! What type of movies do you like? Uh, well... I like the ones where Asian women wrestle with big black mandingos, but aside from that, like... If you're talking about actual movies you go see at a theater... Um... I don't know, just... Gratuitous violence in action, I guess. What is going on, Fesselio? How are you? Is it is it Fesalio or Fesalio? I think it's Fesalio. I might be retarded. I hate it when a boss one hits you as bullshit. I, I like it, provided the one shot makes sense. Like, if you're sitting there and a giant fucking horse falls from the ceiling and lands on you, then uh, you kind of deserve to die, in my opinion. But it, like, if just some random quick attack one shots you, then yeah, I agree. Torch only run and leveling up. What is this? Your first torch run? No, I, I did, like, I'm up to Living Failures on my level 4 torch run. Just I don't feel like doing Living Failures. Going to see Star Wars? Maybe. 
U.S. comedians are generally pretty subpar. Stream PV for the per first time in a while and sent a boss out of the boss room in a fight. Which boss, Dalo? That sounds pretty fucking ridiculous. Must just be in the United States, but holy crap, I hate it when female comedians talk about how slutty they are. Is that actually a thing? Our nation's humors are just too different. They're all torturously unfunny. I don't know. I remember my one of my first run-ins with stand-in comedy, I guess, is I had this fucking chick. Fees Alio? Is it Fees Alio? I, I think that's how, how you're telling me to pronounce it. How's it any worse than a guy talking about fucking a woman? Louis C.K. is God. Most American comedians are shit. Um, what was I saying? What was I saying? Oh yeah, first run in with stand it stand up comedy. My I had like this this chick friend who's like, you need to watch Dan Cook. He's fucking hilarious. I'm like, okay, I'm never doing this shit again. I I don't talk to her anymore. Fisali. Okay, it'll it'll take some time to ram it into my brain. So bear with me. I will I will do my best though. How is it going? Dane Cook? Yeah, dude. It was Dane fucking Cook. I'm just like, Jesus Christ, dude. What? People actually watch this shit. Huh. That that was my reaction. I'm like, Dane Cook. Okay. Should I get the... No, I'm gonna save up the Cathedral Ward key for later, I think. I don't want to risk getting fucked by the laser today. I have a highlight on my channel, Keeper of Old Lords. Gotcha. Good shit. I'll have to check that out at some point. What's going on, Supra? How are you, man? Oh shit, oh shit. No, 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 no. Come here, come here, little beast. Let me, let me torch you. Are you American? Yes, I'm Texan. I'm a fucking cowboy. Does Father Gascoin have a secret look from DLC? Or DLC change the main game? No, he doesn't. Do I'm. The only thing it changes in the main game that I can think of is it adds, like, a chalice dungeon birdbath thing and NPC song. I, I don't know. All of the shit that was added in the DLC slash patch is not actually exclusive from the DLC, I guess. But they added a new covenant and summons and shit. And they also added the, uh... Like I was saying, the birdbath frat party that sells DLC weapons. Lawrence with the torch. No, we're gonna have to whip out the rosemary now for him. Rosemarino. If you're a cowboy, want to recreate Brokeback Mountain? No, not particularly. What type of cars do I like? I like fucking. I don't know. I like I like Honda Elements. Those are those are some pretty good cars. I I like my car. I have a Kia Forte. It's not the best car, but it's something. What's going on, NTH? How are you? I don't like it when any comedy comedian relies too much on sex or dirty humor. It doesn't seem tasteful. Is 110 a good level for PvP? Yes. Mixed tape run? Maybe. Seems like that would be pretty shitty. And I don't think it would be possible. Unless you're just talking about the torch being the permanent mixed tape, then yes. Just run torch only, yes, unless something is extremely resistant to fire, e.g. Lawrence. Then I use the Rosemarinus. You have a killed in accident for what the fuck? I don't I don't even know what that means. What's a good level for co-op? Oh god, I don't know. Probably like I would say 70, 80 maybe, if you're just co-oping with randoms. Seems like that would be able to like maybe like 60, 70 would be able to visit the largest amount of cucks in co-op. Cond element, yeah. I just like I just like nice looking cars. I Lamborghinis, um I don't know. Ford GT. Kia equals killed in an accident. Gotcha. Did not know that. Well hopefully I get killed in an accident then I can uh then I can go visit my my fucking dead guinea pig Yu-Gi-Oh. 
Yes, I, I actually used to have a, a guinea pig named Yu-Gi-Oh. Get summoned pretty instantly at level 180 for Lawrence. Damn. Name your top five album. Oh, God. See, here's the thing. I, I'll do my best, but I'm not like an album person. I like listening to maybe one song from a fucking artist, and then that's it. I might be dead here. Okay, good. We made it. Um, number one album, I guess, is probably... I don't know. I'm gonna get laughed at, probably, but it was my Teenage Angst album. I, I think it was fucking called... God. It was a Muse album. I don't remember what the fuck it was called. It was like Black Holes and Revelations or some shit. Or a it was either that or Absolution. One of the two, I think. Um, and after that, like, I don't I don't know albums. That, that was just my... I'll give you my favorite album. Did your guinea pig duel people? Well, we tried taping, like, little... Uh, we tried taping knives to the guinea pig, and it didn't result in a particularly riveting outcome. We, we tried to force guinea pig battles, like, guinea pig gladiation. Pop music. I, I don't. I don't think music is pop. Favorite genre? I don't even fucking know. I'm just. I'm just gonna fucking just bullshit you and say K-pop. I don't feel like thinking of a real answer. I, I guess just like electronic music that has no lyrics. That damage, yeah. Much more damage than Gracia, yep. But this also isn't New Game Plus 6, so... Can you stop fucking jiggling, bitch? Has it been played on the radio ever? It's pop. That is the dumbest fucking thing I've ever heard. I've heard, I've heard so much shit that nobody could conceivably consider fucking pop that's been on the radio. But if that's you, if... If that's your definition of pop, I'll leave that one alone. Bought a good album the other day, Ratchet Podger playing Bibber's Mist Biber. I don't know, Bibber? I, I have a feeling it's not Bibber. And it's probably Biber's Mystery Sonata. It's fucking Justin Bibber. <laughs> Such a fucking idiot. Okay. I'm usually around 70, 80 when I sit and help people with German. I've been to Texas, don't you have wild roaches that live outside? No, I don't. I've never seen those. Yeah, we, we play like fucking Christian music and country here in Texas, Blind Guardian. I could see your point if it's like a, uh... If it's like the fucking... Like, hit station, top 40 shit. But, there's more variety here. Maybe you just live in like the most cucked radio area ever. Gotta feed my doogie. Those three hunters up there, bitches, they are. I read your name like Shumi Mees. That's his name. His name his name's pronounced Shumi Mees. Justin Bieber, Justin Bieber. I mean, like, top 40 bullshit. Yeah, then fuck that. I remember when, like, I got my car. I had a trial for fucking XM radio, and I was, like, me and my sister were just surfing through the fucking radio stations, and we found, like, this one where it was, like, fucking Playboy, like, talking, like, it's like a Playboy radio station on fucking XM radio. It's talking about how he's just, like, massaging this chick's tits and, like, just coming really, it was like, and I'm sitting here with, like, my fucking 14-year-old sister just listening to this shit, and I'm just cracking up, and, like, I'm pretty sure that traumatized my, my little baby sister, and it was pretty fucking funny, to tell you the truth. I listen to shit like German harsh industrial rhythmic noise like an edgelord. That's African American metal, Blind Guardian. Don't say black metal, please. It's, it's not PC. I love some May Mays. I love Rare Peep and Wild Doggy. Oh shit. The spear fucker here? Incest and pedophilia, you're pretty edgelord in here. He pinched her nipples fiercely, preparing to rip the piercings out as a war cry for anal. I mean, no, I'm, I I just tuned into a fucking radio station that had that playing. And I just continued to listen to it. 
Because I thought, like, just the fucking way the dude was explaining what was happening was pretty fucking funny to me. Why did you do that? Because it was fucking hilarious. It was, the dude sounded like a complete fucking degenerate. I'm only into dad on son. I can respect that. He pinched her nipples fiercely, preparing to rip off the piercing. It was shit like that, actually. Like, that's actually not too far. Oh, shit. What the fuck am I doing with my life? Not too far from the truth. How did you go invisible, Blue Alexa? It is a consumable item. Y'all motherfuckers need Jesus. I do. I miss XM Radio. Aside from, like, the smut shit, there was actually some respectable music on that. Unlike, like, regular FM radio, which, generally speaking, I actually do agree with Blind Guardian. The majority of it is pretty dog shit. Okay. This run going to New Game Plus 6? I mean, God willing, OJ. God willing. We'll, we'll go as far as we can get. I'm a heretic. I don't need Jesus. That. You need Jesus. Hey, it's Christmas. Where's your fucking Christmas spirit? What's going on, Beast Smoker? How are you, man? Hope you're doing well. Traumatizing siblings is what we do. Yeah, you're right. Alright, we're gonna upgrade this and fight the one reborn. It should be interesting. Like Diamond City Radio. <sighs> I hate Christmas. Christmas isn't a Christian holiday. Yeah, I know it's Saturnalia, but the Christians think it's a Christian holiday, so it might it, it's been it's been stolen. It's both now. And I don't think there are too many fucking pagans practicing Saturnalia anymore. I could be wrong, though. I, I, I guess I don't know too many pagans. It's my favorite TV show, probably Breaking Bad. Okay. Just got to the DLC, but Ludwig keeps wrecking me any tips. Okay. Basically, for Ludwig, what you're going to want to do is try not to cry, cry a lot. Phase one, you want to play cautiously, find a couple attacks where you can hit him once and then back the fuck away. Unlike most beasts, you don't want to be just sitting under him smelling his crotch because he'll do the brony stomp and kill you. Um, phase two, you, you want to do the opposite and hug his fucking nuts the entire time. Christians are Catholic. Catholics are Christians. Like, they're like a billion different sects of Christianity. OJ. But yes, if, if you if you believe in the divinity of Jesus Christ, you are a sect of Christianity, and so Catholics count. My niece showed me Japanese girls throwing up in each other's mouth when I was young. Nice. They're doing so many chalices, it's nice to watch some PV runs. The whole of the BB players trying to hunt down the level 3 guidance rune. Yeah, that sounds fun. Any tips for second phase of Orphan of Gods? I do, Bin Khalifa, but like, the advice I'm gonna give you might not make a whole lot of sense unless you watch the video I have on him, which if you want, I can link that for you. But there's a couple of attacks where you can backstab him, charge R2, and basically the entirety of the fight, for me, when I fight, uh, when I fight Orphan Phase 2, I try to stay in front of him, so he only uses close melee attacks, i.e. not the charge. But if you're using a gun, the charge might actually be a good thing for you because the charge is the easiest attack in the game to parry. The long charge he does. If you if you shoot him pretty much during any point of his charge attack, you're gonna knock him down and get a visceral. Aside from that, there are a couple of attacks where he like kind of like he either jumps or like leaps up a little bit, and you can walk under him, and then you will be able to backstab him. And I can't really explain the attacks very well. There's the one where he slams his little shrimp placenta down four times. He does, like, one, two, three. Then there's a delay. He jumps up and he, like, brings it down a four time. And during, in between the third and the fourth, you can walk under him. And it will miss you and you are you will be behind him. And you'll be able to charge R2 him. And if that is, uh, if that is not sufficient, like I said, I have, I have a new game plus six level four vid that demonstrates the strat if you want it. Is there anywhere you can farm blood chunks? Yes, the Chalice Dungeons or the Blue-Eyed Werewolves in the Upper Cathedral War. But I, I don't, I don't recommend that. 
And no problem, Ben. Anytime, man. Those maidens, what the fuck do they do? Uh, they shoot fireballs at you. If you go down and try to fight him. It's your favorite card in Yu-Gi-Oh! Griggle. Griggle is the fucking best. You gonna go for the DLC? Yes. I don't guarantee that I'll beat everything in the DLC, but I'll, I'll attempt it. I just do it at the end. I need a plus 10 for that shit. Yeah, we want him to get closer. He's not close enough to the stairwell. What do the four that don't shoot? I, I was under the impression all of them shoot fireballs. Tolo makes my dilly smile. Celebrate Yule. Makes no sense. What do you mean, what makes no sense? That damage? Yeah, the damage is pretty good, right? The stunlock is not really working too well right now. It is kind of unfortunate. Did atheist people do Christmas? I mean, it's it's more than like a religious holiday now. It's it's a consumer holiday. T I kind of want to see Tolo get caught by Miko. Actually, my car broke down. I had to ride the city bus today, and the guy I was sitting by threw up on me. Sounds like you've had a really shit day, Grizz. I hope he gets better. My parents are atheists. I mean, I'm I'm an atheist, and I like Christmas. Well, I'm at least I like getting shit for Christmas. <laughs> I should rephrase that. There we go. What do you have you leveled up to do that damage? Arc I have level 30 arcane Fuju. What is going on, Tan Manager? How are you, my man? I'm gonna go to the Hunter's Dream and I'm gonna let my dog out and get a drink, and then we will, we will go back to Cuck Amygdala. I kind of I kind of don't want to move right now because my dog looks very comfortable. It's time to go out, pup. You always bypass the first chick and run back. The reason I do that is basically a holdover for my level four run. What, if you immediately go to the left, he's basically gonna, like, he's in the position where he's gonna spit at you and deal damage, and that one shot's at level 4, so it's just a habit. I, it's so I don't get hit with the first round of vomit, basically. Okay, now, now I'll be right back.
One sip. Oh, okay. I'm back where we at it in the run. We just beat one reborn. Okay. Jesus was born in February. Oh God. Let me make sure I didn't miss anything. How did you say it? amygdala? I say it amygdala. The game pronounces it amygdala, but basically the amygdala is a structure in your brain like it's a real thing and it's actually pronounced amygdala so that's how i pronounce it christmas is like living a lie knowing that it's a lie but still going with it christmas is a good excuse to get free shit <laughs> it i don't know i think christmas and all other holidays are basically like consumer traps where you Companies just market shit to take advantage of you. Tell us the story. I've never fallen out of a tree, actually. Pretty proud of that. One of my best accomplishments was not doing something. What is love? Love? I don't know. Good question. I don't think reality is a good place to prove it. <laughs> we having a religious debate right now. Played Lords of the Fallen? No. Could buy all those presents at any time of the year? Yes, you could. Okay, so we need to get our stamina rune and our health rune, and eventually we're going to start putting more points into our game. <laughs> For not saying, baby, don't hurt me. I, I, I've said it like 17 fucking times when that question has been posed to me. But the thing is, people wouldn't appreciate them as much. I mean, basically, holidays are a way to break out of everyday monotony. Like, that's that's the function of a holiday for society. It just so happens that one of them involves gift giving. Why not 18? Because 18, like, 18's... I, I don't like that number. Those people who turn their house into a lighted up mess is, is funny. <laughs> what is love? Never mind, what is a dirty Sanchez? Are you a Dark Souls virgin? What does that even fucking mean? If you're asking if I've never played Dark Souls, then I, I played all of the Souls games. If you're asking if I'm a virgin who plays Dark Souls and I'm a fucking 510 King of the Manlet Turbo Virgin, um, hope that answers your question. Ever played Resident Evil? Only Resident Evil 5. What is the proper response to what is a scrub me? Take the piss out of yourself before people do it to you. <clears throat> Have you ever been fucked by Bed of Chaos? Dude, hasn't everyone? Okay. Damn. That's one one good thing about the torch. It's very effective against the sideways werewolves. Betamax permavergence on the internet. It's more likely than you think. How many rap battles have you won? At least 17. At least 17. The last time I had a rap battle was versus WTF Guar, and he lost very hard. You can ask him about it. He'll confirm the story. And so will Heretic Ramza. It's a guy who can't get no love from me, also known as a bust. Okay, my apologies. You've won rap battles. Total rap for us? No, you have to donate at least $500 to get a private subscriber-only rap session. Sorry. Tolo is a pagan fuck, but no, I'm actually a Wiccan. And I'm a fuck person. Don't don't gender me, you cis white male. Are you Eminem? Yes. I sexually identify as a Sam Squanch. I'll do it if you buy me a pizza. Okay. 
Tolo is a wicked. Be careful. He'll cast a hex on you by drawing a pentagram with max scare. You're goddamn right, I will. You don't shoot fucking five, get it. Paganism and Wiccanism is the same thing you worship, Lamb, but each each has its own cult, own different cult of special snowflakes. Why do you do this this slow shit? I can't fucking talk right now. You mean like the torch? Okay. Fuck, stop frenzying me. It's not the it's not the nice thing to do. I have Tolo's Twitch info. I'm currently practicing towards becoming a rap god. Yeah, that was like three months ago. I'm a rap legend now. That's one step above God. Run along the right while it's fast. Maybe I just like rolling in the mud. Have you ever thought of that, Blind Guardian? Maybe I enjoy doing it that way. Stop backseat gaming me. Are you gonna get caught by the Hamburglar? Probably. Nope. Give me the noggin. Backseat boys. Hey yeah. Can't believe you guys are fucking backseating me. Holy shit, I cannot hit its arms with the damn of this fucking thing. Welcome back, Papa Dad. You think Christianity is like PlayStation for it? What the fuck? I don't even know what you're trying to relay to me. Do you think Christianity is like PlayStation? For, you mean like they enjoy Christianity like they would a PlayStation? Probably not. In my experience, no, that is not the case. At least, at least we're burning through this fucker reasonably quickly with the torch. It's not like a, a really fast kill or anything, but it's, it's moderately quick compared to some of the others. Where did you buy this game? I can't find it on Steam. I bought it at uh, a flea market. It's a hacked ROM. It, if, you're, if you're actually being legit, you don't know, then it's, uh, it's PS4 only. There we go. Burn the dick. Yeah, that actually was working reasonably well. If I could aim it, aim it at the dick frequently enough to do damage, it would be a pretty quick kill. But I, I would whiff and hit the uh, the knee or something. Torch run is doable on regular game, but not DLC. I mean, we're gonna do DLC too, Bakuda. We're just doing it last. Okay, so Boku no Miko, my favorite boss in the fucking game. It's doable on everything. Bloodborne is the best exclusive right now for PS4. Oh my god, I didn't get the fucking stamina rune, okay. Can you explain whiff? It means that I missed. I fucked Supergirl last night. Nice. I don't even know what that means. Who's Supergirl? Which one? PS4, or Xbox One? Well, I, I like this game. This is the only console game I played, so PS4 for me. I really hope that the torch does good damage against Miko. This little guy, this guy's a little hack. I guess he's not a little guy, but I meant to say his little hack kind of makes me giggle. I heard Miko's name. I'm triggered. Nice. Are you joking? If you're if you're talking to me about not knowing who Supergirl is, and no, I'm not. Do you have a witch girlfriend? No. I had another king girlfriend once, though. She identified as a fucking sea slug. 
nights out on the town were interesting. Let's just sit, put it that way. If a teen the size of a 12 year old can take Mandingo's dick up the ass, anything is possible, damn. Other kin, I mean, what's wrong with other kin? Are you discriminating to Tommy? Oh shit, I should probably level up. Oh, the damage is just, it is so shit no matter what I do. It's just so fucking awful. Throw salt on that sea slug? No, that's not, that's not very nice. Scene zero dawn? No, I haven't. Alright, so we'll do Mikalash. Hopefully, hopefully we will uh, not die to the elevator following Mikalash. That would be pretty bad. And then we can uh, then we can start doing the fun shit. We'll do a Breedus, Lugarius, and then the DLC. <sighs> okay. Do you know who Superman is? Yes. If if you're talking about like Wonder Woman, that's what one that's what she's called as far as I know. If you're talking about like the girl version of Superman. Wonder Woman, I think is unless they changed it into Supergirl, I might be I might be retarded. I pay this twenty one year old blonde girl three thousand dollars a month to have sex with me three times a week, twelve times a month. How sad am I? I mean I don't know. You have enough money to blow on a fucking twenty one year old blonde girl, so you can't be that sad. <laughs> the fuck? Oh my god, some of the comments. There is a Supergirl? Okay, I didn't know that. Well, I, I don't know shit about superheroes. I've never watched like a Batman movie, for example. Pretty much my extent of... The extent of superhero knowledge for me was like Teen Titans. What did you do as a child? Video games and drugs. And Legos. I've never, I've never been into the superhero shit. It just never was appealing for me personally. Rich and single, but I'm ugly and can't get women to talk to me. Well, you don't need to talk to them when you can pay them. Look on the bright side, man. You could always be ugly and poor, and then you'd be fucked. So, I, I don't think you're that sad. Start dressing like you're rich and they will talk to you. Stop being weird. I'm... <laughs> Tolo snorted Legos. I want to have a family and have kids. I'm worried about my future. Um... I can't help you there. I, I have no nothing to say on the topic of family and kids. You should watch the documentary of Rob Thomas. Okay, Sheeta. All right. Tumblr knew about this chat. There would be an all-out wars that would rip the internet a new ass. So I don't think so. This, it, as bad as this is, sometimes like sometimes it's bad against feminists, but it's not even fucking half as vitriolic as some of the shit on Reddit or whatever the fuck else website like 4chan. Although it would be pretty funny. I, I would get a chuckle out of it if, like, Tumblr declared war on this channel or some shit. That would be amusing to me. Okay, okay. You want to get married? Fuck no, I don't, dude. Are you kidding me? Why would I want to get married? I just want to play fucking video games. Each chain declared war on SJW's Twitch channel. Five cents to says Tolo is more rich than Cthulhu. I have cash, but Twitch doesn't accept cash for sub. What is the best Lego to snort? The the circuit like the little circle cylinder ones are really good. And there's and there's the little plastic crystal ones too. Get into Marvel and DC and you won't regret it. I don't it's not up my alley. Oh shit, does the torch actually stun those guys? I was about to be really happy for a second. If I was ten years younger, I'd say the same thing, Tolo. He sounds so offended. I, I I do not like the idea of ever getting married. It's it's like blasphemy to me. 
Shut the fuck up, Mikalash. Oh, fuck. Okay. I have to take these guys seriously. Why wait? We should declare war on Tumblr. Oh, yeah. That, that would go well. Oh, cause. Shut the fuck up and get in the cage, bitch. His yodels trigger me so hard, saying. Me too, call me the cleaner. Oh! Ho -ho. Alright, let's see how bad this ends up being. Oh my god, our damage is fantastic. I'm, I'm really feeling it right now. Just tremendous damage coming out from T-Dog. <laughs> god fucking damn it. This run is starting to upset me a little bit. Gotta get 4chan involved. If Tumblr declared war on your channel, Tolo, you would get a lot more views than before. I don't give a fuck about that. I, I want to be able to come in here and not have to listen to, like, really, really stupid shit every fucking time I stream. That would kind of kill it for me, honestly. Would you be doing more damage with your fists? No. Making it to new game plus six? Yeah, we are. No problem. Should have done a perma death with a real weapon. If we die, we'll do Moonlight Grey Sword or something. <laughs> that damage. They would leave as soon as they discover we can't be helped. What's going on, Suski? Please, how are you, man? Okay. Now we got to successfully complete phase two, which might be an, an issue. Is that the only attack he does? No. This ride is actually dope to me because Tolo has the possibility to die to new game bosses besides DLC ones. What's going on, Beast Smoker? FYI, you're a pre-cool dude. Well, hopefully I, I can get to a post-cool dude status one day. But I appreciate that. The flame shank is real. What is the dumbest run you've ever done? Probably Fist of Grashy or Fist only. One of the two. Torch is fucking horrible. It, it was actually really good for Amygdala, but now now that Miko is has entered the building, it's 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 not going all that well. You gotta be honest. Man, fuck you and your Tiger Falcon Palm Fist bullshit. Nice damage. You almost got me, Mikolash. <laughs> I'm surprised level 4 no dodge. I actually really enjoyed that run. I got salty on Headless Bloodletting Beast, yes. But, like, figuring out new strategies for a lot of the bosses was really enjoyable for me. Like, if I got stuck, I couldn't just say, okay, let's look up and see what someone else has done. Because I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure, like, I'm still the only one who's done that shit. Like, maybe no dodge, no roll runs have been done, like, the main game on a leveled character. But, like, level 4 chalice dungeon bosses, I think I, think I was, like, the pioneer for that shit. Is Beast Cutter better than the Saw Cleaver? No, but Beast Cutter's still really good. He was gonna do Call Beyond right when you landed on his head. Yeah, he always does. That's why you gotta hope that you uh you land on his head. Tiger Falcon fucking tra yeah, that's what he does, man. What what else would you call it? Okay, so now we need to not get fucking diddled by the brain bitches. 
Dragon Ball Miko. I haven't seen anyone else do it. Exactly, that's what I'm saying. Like, it, I had to figure everything out. Like, if I got stuck on, say, like, a Guns Only run or some shit, I could be like, okay, I'm gonna log off, see, see you guys later, and, like, look up a strat or some shit. You know what I mean? Whereas, I was up Shit Creek without a paddle. No dodge. How long has the stream been going? Three hours. Oh, wow! Oh, wow! Please don't fuck this up. It's been a long time since I fucked that up, but I, I have a feeling it's gonna happen one day. One of the cool things about Torch Only Run is I don't have to get the fucking gems so we can just run through and not worry about, like, actually running in between the brain harlots, which I'm a fan of. This shit really is no problem whatsoever if you don't have to get that gem. Level 4, no dodge, no... Yeah, it was really fun. I enjoyed it a lot. I I mean, I, I know that, like, a lot of people did not enjoy the, uh, the headless bloodletting beast portion of that run, but I think, I think it was enjoyable even to watch up until that point. Although Abhorrent Beast was kind of bad, too. Plus the explosive Mika Bitch Club Clap. Yeah, that's that's another one. You gotta watch out for that one. That, that shit just comes out of left field. I really wish this had a gem slot. I'm gonna reiterate that. Alright, Rhapsody. Take it easy, man. Have a good one. I like how you're invisible, but you have a giant flame hovering four feet off the ground. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> If I see myself doing a level 1 run, you have to beat it. You have to beat Manus, Calamy, and Gwyn. You have to, like, give me a screenshot or some shit of you in possession of all of their souls. To Tommy. Okay, so we're gonna upgrade and then we're gonna do Nurse. And then after that we'll do probably Logarius. No roll dash was great. Bloodborne is fucking easy because you can just regen all your health in one hit. Yeah, dude. Artarian was a legend. I can beat it. Then do it, man. Go for it. I believe you. I don't think it's that bad either. Like, oh shit. I fucked it up. Like, there are a couple of uh, rough spots, but he could mod it. He could. Maybe we have to make it Bloodborne exclusive then. Okay. I'm trying to think what I want to do here. The plus 10 torch of destiny indeed, dude. We're, we're ready to fuck. Our suit is very, very tight. Let's go show Wet Nurse our new, our new sir, er, our new suit. Excuse me, I can't fucking speak. Got the dick in my mouth. Want to do level 4 run to become a spaceman, but how will I send you proof? Just take a screenshot. Just stat screen, level 4 after Orphan. Like, I only care about you beating Orphan. And I guess Lawrence. Have you done Waste of Skin run through? Yes. Level 4 Bloodborne run is even easier for me than I put because I played more Bloodborne. But it ha you need to do Cause though. Have you done Level 4 Orphan yet? What is going on, fam? And how are you today? Demon Souls would also work. I actually think Demon Souls is harder than Dark Souls 1 for the level 1 run, just only for one reason, and that is basically False King Alon, and more specifically the run back to False King Alon should you die. Do you need Chalice Dungeon? No. I think, I think Orphan is sufficient. Gotta go to bed. So many hours of schoolwork has got me fucked up. Alright, Tan Manager. Take it easy, man. Have a good night. Tolo speaking in tongues like a good con Christian text in your congregation must be so proud. You're right. Permadeath runs triggered me. I hate deleting characters. I do, too. Alright, Anuj. Take it easy, man. Is it hard? It, yeah, I mean, it's, it's moderately difficult. It gets really hard when you do the Chalice Dungeons, but just regular game isn't too horrible. Especially since you can technically beat the game without fighting a Breedis, German, or Logarius, which are the only hard bosses. 
you don't really have to fight anything particularly difficult to technically finish the run without leveling up. Damage isn't too horrible yet. We can work with this. We can work with this. Wow, that wasn't nice at all. What the fuck, Harlot? Okay. Shadows can also be tough. I've actually never had a, like too much issue with regular shadows level 4. Damage is good, yeah, it's acceptable. It's not good, but it's not gonna make the fight take three fucking years, so it's it's fine. Is the clone out? I think the clone's out. Nope, it's not. Lucky us. This has 14,000 HP. Yes, it does. It, has, it is probably the tankiest enemy in the main game, I think. Outside of DLC. Did it strangle the man IRL? What do you recommend for hand cramps? No, and no. Bloodwig New Yen has 16k. Yeah, in the main game, not including DLC, I'm pretty sure this has the most HP. Gonna go play my all arcane character. Alright, man. Take it easy and have fun. Demon Souls Pure Black World for False King a lot. My personal Hunter's Nightmare. That sounds awful. That sounds absolutely horrible. If anyone is wondering why there was no clone, the clone only comes out when she reaches like 66% or lower HP. If we exclude chalices and DLC, yeah. I think Loran Dark Beast has some, somewhere in the neighborhood of 23,000. Lawrence just blows everyone out of the water with 20k HP regularly. That is pretty fucking ridiculous, isn't it? Wish I had Bloodborne. Damn. Uh, do you just not have a PS4? Because I, I, I know that, like... Well, no, I knew I was going to be in that position. So I bought a PS4 just for Bloodborne. What's going on, Osnova? How are you, man? Whoa, lag. Is it... Is the stream fucking up again? Living failures have the most health. It's back? Okay, then we're probably done for the night if it's... If it's lagging. Okay. Is anyone else having the lag issues? Defiled Watchdog is 28.7k. That's not... Yeah. <clears throat> Watchdog and Amygdala have just excessively bloated levels of HP. It's pretty fucking funny. I don't know why they have so much. Like, <clears throat> I think Abhorrent Beast only has like 20, 21k. But Debt 4 Watchdog has almost 30,000. No lag here, okay. It was just me, alright. Gotcha. I appreciate the feedback. Stream has been perfect all night, okay. Then we will continue to torch the motherfuckers. All these people out of the woodwork. That's that's the way to get chat reinvigorated, I guess, it just says, is the stream lagging? Okay, you can stop using that fucking attack. Come on, bitch. You have to do another shadow phase, because she's not cooperating right now. Can't wait for Dark Souls 3, me, me either. I'm, I'm really... I'm really excited. Oh, shit. Excited for Dark Souls 3 now. Like, I was more hyped for BBDLC. But now that that is come and gone, I'm, I'm on the Dark Souls 3 hype train. I want to try to get you before your next shadow phase. That would be nice. Dark Beast is 20.6k. I think the file watchdog is highest HP in the entire game. No. It, I mean, in regular new game, yes. 
boy, I'm pretty sure New Game Plus 6 Lawrence has like almost 50,000 HP or some shit. What is going on, Daft Puppy? How are ya? Oh shit. <laughs> the 948 damage combo, is that the fucking god? I actually don't want to dodge into that. That's probably the most dangerous attack in her repertoire. Okay, time to run. It's like in April, Os Nova. Chalices don't scale the new game level, yeah. So, like, Watchdog is supposed to be the equivalent of, like, a new game plus three or four. <laughs> Daft puppy hype. <laughs> Congrats, puppy. You're the only user who gets it. hype. I plat Bloodborne Amazing, almost plat Dark Souls 2. Nice, good shit. Four months. Four months isn't that long away. Considering we just got Bloodborne DLC. Didn't want to be in a place where I didn't have Bloodborne, sold two comics to pay off my PS4. Jesus Christ, two comics to pay that off? They must have been very valuable comics. <laughs> Alright. What nerd? Oh shit. There's that, that thing where she just decides to instantly do that with no wind up. What nurse is down? Let's go and visit Martyr Logarius. Like, actually, 